Hello everybody, Berto Guy here and welcome back. Alright, so we're back on our little Minecraft world. A new beginning. That's what this is. is. It's a new beginning. That's how she rolls, man. Alright, so today I'd like to get this little area over here started and get some farms up in there. Uh, that's kind of my goal. Uh, probably going to make it like a multi-layered kind of something like this. Uh, so the first one we might put some, oh, I don't know. We'll leave it for redstone stuff later uh, because I'd like to put a micro farm over there eventually. Uh, what else would I like to put over there? Um, oh, and then I want to put an AFK fishing farm up here, which would be nice. And then... Yeah, and then we'll just do farms over there, and like we'll do like the whole melon farm and all that stuff, and yeah, that's gonna be today's plan. So we're gonna just make our way over there first of all, and we'll start making a platform because that's what we're gonna do. So I made the other ones pretty simple. Um, can't really go wrong with the way I made it. So one, two. Three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, that almost touches. Because I made all of those seven. Really? Hmm. Wow. That's pretty crazy. Because I was kind of hoping to have kind of like a little like rope bridge <laughs> going in between, but if it's just like, uh, and it's done, hmm. I don't know. I guess I'm going to build it and see what it looks like on the ground if they're both attached. And if they're something I can do, maybe maybe I'll build a tree. Because I have quite a bit of uh, jungle wood. So maybe I got enough to actually build a tree. And then I could put it in the middle as like maybe looking like it's supporting it. I don't know. Kind of. <laughs> I don't know. We'll go with that. Alright, so what I'll do is I'll go and we'll start building this. Oh, screw it, right? Yeah, we'll do a little bit together and so I can talk a little bit, I guess, right? Because we all love talking. Yeah, so my plans are, like I said, I want to get things a little spread out around here. And the fact that it's not going to be even, like, matched up is going to kind of drive me up the wall, too. Hmm, I wonder how well that's going to work. I'll just get around you. Because I did it kind of like this for... I know it's going to be one out on that side. See, this is what I'm talking about, working with oddly shaped things and trying to make them come together. See, why does it do that? I hate when it does that. There's nothing that irritates me more than when the block goes down. I was clearly pressing to the side. Clearly pressing. See, look click. I wonder if it's because I pushed too close to the bottom and it... Aha! So is that way an easy... Look at that. Huh. So that's an easy way to get bottom slabs. Huh. I don't like that. So make sure you're at least in the middle. Huh. So maybe, is that something that was implemented like that or is that just a freaking bug? Well, I don't like it. I don't like it. Not at all. Not at all. So yeah, because this comes out here like this now. And see, this is how this one became oddly shaped as well. Is because these two were so close together that they kind of like mixed up the pattern a little bit. But that's fine. That's fine. Maybe we can work with it. We can change it out a little bit here. Uh, although, yeah, that's really, really, really going to get on my nerves. I'm probably going to lose so many slabs because I'm not running down there all the time to go pick up a freaking slab. No, sorry, Bob. I am not doing that. I am not running downstairs all the time just to pick up slabs. Alright, so... And then we went one out here. So, you know what? We'll just try to... See what happens. See how this looks when I'm done. Oh. Yeah, I'm so glad that <laughs> there was vines there. I would have taken a dirt dive. <laughs> oh, it's too funny. Yeah, because if I can kind of keep it this way somewhat oddly shaped, but then kind of make it a little, I don't know, 
We can see then the center of the tree is not really around, you know, how I have it based over here. Hmm. Hmm. Can I move the tree? <laughs> <laughs> Do I want to go to that extent? I don't know. Um, I'll think about it. I'll come back and I'll just play around with this and... I'll see what uh, what I can come up with, but I do want to be able to get over here and not have to like kind of ziggy zaggy type thing. So unless 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 I just make it kind of like in the middle of these three, well no, then I would just kind of throw it all off. What's really holding it up, right? Yeah, because that was the whole purpose of me doing this. Is like the trees are holding it up. Uh. All right, well, I'll think about it. I'll come back, and I'll have something for you when I come back. I'll brainstorm about it there, and, yeah, and we'll do it. All right. <laughs> All righty, we're back. We're back. Yes. All right, we're back. Um, so I came up with something anyways. Um, this is what I came up with. Uh, this is where my AFK fish farm is going to go with, and, uh, yeah, that's it. No, I'm just bugging it. Um, so this, <laughs> this is kind of like the concept of the outlining of it, it's where it's going to go. So this does kind of work, you know, works for me anyways. Uh, and then I decided to make up another little platform right here that's going to go around this tree. Um, just figuring, I have no idea what I'm going to do with this area, but I figured, hey, why not? It would look decent. Another little area, maybe that'll be the bedroom. You'll come in, you'll sleep, you can come back here, go to bed, you know, right here. <laughs> Walk all the way around the tree, just go to bed. Because yeah. this is walking this way is a little awkward, you know. Got to squeeze in there. If you're really chubby, well, you're going to have a hard time getting through. Yeah, kind of like me. Um, so, yeah, I got to go get some more uh, spruce wood, unfortunately, because uh, I'm just about out, too. So, yeah, that's kind of crappy. And then we have to design a roof for this as well. Um, you know what? This just doesn't suit me. I'm not kind of happy with that. I was wondering if I should put some stairs going around that, like, downwards. Because I don't like how it ends very flush. It shouldn't end flush. That's what I'm thinking. I think... I was just looking at that now, and it was just... It didn't seem right, so maybe I can go around it and like I'll experiment with just this little part right here, okay? Hear me out, bear my bear me. All right, so where's my stairs? All oh, their way over there. Dope. All right, we'll just put them side by side. Uh, and then maybe if I do, if I do, well, that's kind of crappy, really. they're underneath eh? I'd like it to be kind of like that honestly like right there but because that's a friggin top slab or a bottom slab yeah it's a bottom slab I don't get that same look but if I went and just maybe pop them all out it would probably help change the, the look of it a little bit I still did want it to go down though, which is unfortunate. Hmm. I don't know, I'll think about that. But I know I'm definitely going to bring it all out, one like this. It'll look a lot nicer. And probably do the same to the bottom as well. Wouldn't that be better? I don't know. Maybe that's just pushing it, but. Hmm. Yeah. Kind of like that. I wonder if those would look good going around. Or some kind of like fence posting there and like there. That well, maybe wouldn't be too too bad. Hmm, do I have any fence on me? Let's go check this out. You know, this like I said, it's all about the whole building series and the whole getting your first base uh all up and up to par here. Probably gonna run out of food soon before I get this built. That would be well, obviously I'll go hunting and Collecting food. Okay, so same color blends in too much, but kind of gives it like 
I don't know, a different look to it. And if I use a different color of wood, well, you'd see like two tone, I guess, in a sense. But that just kind of almost gives the block like a different, I don't know, a different look. Let me just try it on this side and see if I like this. Kind of odd, but you don't really notice it that much, do you? Probably in this texture. Well, this is the what the heck do they call that? The nature texture pack, natural, natural. All right, so let's parkour this without dying. Pick these back up. Um, I don't want to put those ones there. Then, I don't know. Let's see what those look like. Because I got them like kind of floating around the base as it is. And I'm not 100%. I had some on me, but whatever. Uh, I'm not 100% like, you know, happy with them. But they're there for now. Until I figure something else to put there. But, I don't know. Just to give me an idea of what this would look like. I'll see, and then you don't even see the wood behind it anymore. You just see that, and yeah, no, I don't like that either. Not at all, not at all. Hmm. Very strange. Oh well, um, I'll probably figure out some other different kind of wood. I'll leave those there for now as a reminder of what I want to do, and then, then I just got to fix up this top room. And then fix this one up, and then we can lay in some farms. So let's try to lay out where we want our farms here. Like, this is obviously going to change the height of how this is. And this was my goal, was just to get some small farms going on here. Um, probably going to need a water source block back there somewhere. So, I don't want these too big either. Like, I just want them enough so that way I can get some kind of food and I don't want to like overtake the whole area with you know dirt blocks like I still wanted to make it look relatively freaking nice you know and then maybe I can do something like this and then yeah um, fortunately I wouldn't be able to get hydrated though which Unless I knocked out, I cheated and I knocked out the block back here. I could put a water source block there. Like this. And then I could put those logs back. Alright, yeah, that works for me. And then that could still all nice and hydrated. The only thing I don't like is I was thinking about putting like stairs here. But like we'll use this as an example even though the, probably not the best color stairs to be using but so I did want certain things to kind of stand out oh my bad and then see it doesn't really give you well it does but and then you got the whole trickery corner thing to do here and then that just cuts out space and that looks make it looks ugly but see on this side it would be okay it would kind of work on this side say if I were to do that like that you'll have that one gap in here and it would be fine see you don't seem so crowded and I would probably have to do something like this to close it off and the same thing on this side, but then you're going to get that stupid thing here. It's going to connect. And that's not nice. See, and that's what I would want. Yeah. So maybe scratch the one off in the middle. What do you all think? I think that the one in the middle is going to go. Like I said, I don't need like a ton of stuff growing. I just want to start growing something. That way I can get some food, right? Poor guy's gonna starve to death. We don't want that. We don't want to starve. Oh, running out of tools, we're gonna have to go make ourselves some new tools too. My lord, running out of everything. Uh, just like in real life. Um, 
All right, here we go. We'll put that back. Uh, all right, so I guess we can we can live with this, and then just a couple types of farms here. Uh, I don't have that much to plant anyway. It's really to be honest with you. So what do we got to plant here, other than freaking melons? That's it, melons. I didn't even get a grass seed yet. Huh. All right. Well, that's pretty much all the basic idea of what I'm gonna go for. Uh, just a small little farming thing here, something that we can get a little bit of food from. Uh, need be later on, like I said, I'd like to put in a micro farm so that way I can make these obsolete. These little things here. And that actually might not be a bad idea for later on of having the micro farm up there. And then maybe coming down here and uh, maybe, 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 maybe just making storage for the food. Uh, that's plausible. You know, like I said, it's not going to be a super huge resource base, this thing. It's just something to kind of like um, start us off with, right? So, but I still just wanted to make it nice at the same time, kind of hospitable, you know. Uh, yeah, that's pretty much all it. So, but uh, I think that's all the time I got for today. So we're going to call that an episode, and in the next episode I'm going to have the roof on this, or the second level done, and then the roof on it, and hopefully some grass seeds growing in here, and then these right here, the way it's kind of like open up here and you can kind of like fall off, I'm not really 100% sure yet of what I'm going to do, what kind of a railing I'm going to build on that thing, kind of, you know, so you don't just fall off all the time. Because it's going to happen to me. I know it will. I'm freaking famous for it. So we did get some uh, sugar cane as I ran around here earlier trying to look for some. Because we're going to need some for some books later on. Because um, like, we got to get at least an enchanting table going on here somewhere too, you know. And then we got the AFK fish farm that I want to get going. But i got to go kill some mobs first because I'm going to need some string. So, yeah, that's pretty awesome gonna have to spend some time at night there maybe I'll go sit on the island at night I'll make myself a little like place to hide and I'll let the mob spawn and I'll run over there or out of there and kill them and stuff yeah well we'll see how that is, how it works but thanks for watching everybody uh, please like the video and subscribe if you haven't and we'll see you next time peace take care